Brad Mark, your engineer with the Oklahoma Department of Transportation, so how did ODOT uh, find out about the, the Monarch flight and what efforts to attract and preserve them? Well, in, in 2014, uh, President Obama issued a memorandum to all the federal agencies uh, that told them to start efforts to protect habitat for pollinators in the monarch butterfly. There's a great deal of uh, concern by scientists for our pollinators. Uh, monarch butterfly has seen a 90% reduction in its number since the 1990s. And beekeepers are having a very hard time keeping their hives uh, viable. So there's, the thought is that if you help the monarch butterfly, uh, you'll also be helping those other pollinators which are uh, responsible for 30% of our food supply. So what's been done here? Where are we and what's going on? We're here at the I-35 Wel Tourism Welcome Center in Oklahoma City, uh, northeast Oklahoma City, and we've created a monarch way station. And the Monarch Way Station is basically a butterfly garden. Uh, and there is a, uh, an organization called Monarch Watch uh, that is kind of leading this effort nationally. And they have a way station registration uh, uh, program. So this, this plot has been registered as a Monarch Way Station with Monarch Watch. And, uh, in, in the fall of last year, uh, we had people from our uh, environmental programs division uh, attend some meetings in Iowa about the plight of the monarch, and we started hearing about these issues last fall. I got to attend a transportation leadership summit in, at, in the White House office complex uh, regarding the habitats for pollinators. So, since that time, uh, we've started to respond to the effort by planning to reduce our mowing and also create this way station as an educational tool to let people know about the flight of the mall. Explain to me what we have here exactly, what the flowers are, what they do, and all that. Well, the way station has five different types of milkweeds. And the milkweed is uh, the only plant that a monarch butterfly will lay its eggs on. It's the only plant that the caterpillars can eat. So they complete their life cycle on the milkweed. Uh, the adults can nectar on, on many different uh, flowers, but the larvae and the caterpillars can only uh, utilize a milkweed. So we've got five types of milkweeds here. Uh, tropical milkweed, which is a non-native. Uh, we have butterfly weed, antelope horns milkweed, green antelope horns milkweed, and uh, a whorled milkweed.